Hey guys, my name is K Nell, R Nell for short, doesn't matter. And welcome back to my channel, or I should probably tell myself welcome back because I've been away for a while and it's only because my computer died. Like, my hard drive broke down, it crashed, and it just kind of got me down. So recently, I turned 21. <laughs> You know what that means. Hey, I can go out and do absolutely nothing because I'm still in school and I have responsibilities. You guys should take my example. I'm the real leader here. I have no life. But on top of turning 21, I have a special guest with me. Come here. This is my dog, Zuko. He's my little fire prince. Hey, yes, I named him Zuko after Zuko. Look at the camp. I named him Zuko after character. He just karate chopped me in the neck. Zuko, really? You just gonna be difficult, huh? I named him Zuko because that was my favorite character in Avatar growing up, and he actually has his personality as well. He's Spoiled. He does what he wants to. He don't listen. He's lazy. Oh wait, I'm just describing myself. <laughs> Zuko, get from over there. He found the pretzel and started eating it. Zuko, that pretzel's not yours. Wait, that's not a pretzel. Come here. That doesn't look like a pretzel to me. He was chewing on a piece of wood. How does this stuff get in my room? So today what we're going to be doing is five of the easiest cartoon impressions ever. In addition to the five cartoon impressions, we are going to add one hard one. It's not even a cartoon, but you know, it could be fun to do. But I want you to stay tuned for the end just for that one, and I'm going to show you how to do it just like the rest of them. Okay? Okay. So with that, let's start. Number one. Give you get and go ahead. So number one is Cartman. Cartman is the annoyingest character in South Park, but he's also really funny. So in order to do his voice, in a way you have to dumb your voice down and your lips are like really tucked in. So I'm just talking like this in general. Once you guys got that down, you just have to say things that he will say. Me. Respect my daughter. Number two is Stitch. Stitch and Cartman does tie into each other. It's all about how you tuck in your lips, but with Stitch, you kind of want to bring your tongue back, like push it back. Like that. Ohana means family. Family means no one gets left behind. It can be my mom. And now we're going to get into some of my favorites. So number three on this list is Patrick. Star. For Patrick, all you have to do is basically you have to dumb yourself down. This may sound weird, but when you dumb or thinking about dumbing yourself down, you become lazy and so kind of does your voice. You kind of want to get like in this kind of voice right here. What about Patrick is like he has a really kind of husky voice, so you have to push it forward. You set the M for many when it should be W for Wumbo. I wombo, you wombo, he, she, we, wombo, wombo, womboing. <laughs> you gotta have his attitude as well. It's a giraffe. <laughs> Number four on this list is Ed from Ed, Ed, and Eddie. So you kind of have the mentality for Patrick, right? It's kind of the same thing and it ties into each other. Except for Ed is going to be slightly higher, all right? Ed loves chickens, right? So whenever he sees a chicken, what does he say? Chicken today! <laughs> Butter toast double D. I am Ed! Cheese and macaroni! Swiggity swag! What's in the bag? So number five on this list is Kurt the Calorie Dog and it's not really his voice in general that I can do it's just his babbling basically babble in a highish pitch voice so it's like bah, 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 bah. <laughs> we were able to get through all five we got through Cartman, Stitch, Patrick, Ed, and Kurt the Calorie Dog well his babbling part 
We're gonna do one more, all right? And this one is not a cartoon or anything like that. This is gonna be Ariana Grande's voice, okay? And it's not just her voice in general, it's her high-pitched singing, all right? You don't really have to know how to sing, but you wanna know how to get up to high pitches, okay? So you kinda wanna just start with a random note. Uh, go to the next pitch for it. Uh, Go to the next pitch for it. Ah! Okay? So, you can get up there, right? You just have to believe you can get up there, okay? So, I'm going to be doing a small part for one of her songs, and it's going to be the song The Way. So, I'm going to show you that clip. Here it is. So, guys, quick warning. Before I actually do this part, it's gonna sound really, really bad, but you guys should already know that I'm not a singer. All right, here we go. And yeah guys, that's pretty much it. Those are my five impressions that I think everyone should know and are pretty much the easiest. It's kind of like, if you think about it, a conversation breaker, like an easy way to impress people. If you like it, please leave a piace, a thumbs up, and or leave a comment telling me anything else I could have did better or like giving me tips or anything like that or if you want to see more impressions, maybe more Pokemon impressions. Who knows? It's up to you guys, okay? Thank you guys so much and I'll see you later. Bye.